Howdy gang, Nismo D21 channel checking in and look at what we did. Two things, two great things. One, this truck is out of storage finally. It was trapped thanks to uh, somebody who probably knew better but took their keys with them. So the vehicle that was behind this truck was uh, not movable. Uh, I would have wrapped the chain around the thing dragged it out myself if I really wanted to be a major uh, a-hole, but I didn't want to put up with that, so I said, eh, I'll just wait it out. It's raining anyways, but today is a beautiful, nice, sunny day, and uh, so here she is. I just drove her back from work. I'm going to grab some, uh, some chow here. Just wanted to find a place off the road here that I could uh, take some shots. Give you guys the update. The other thing is, look at this. Back in the uh, late 80s and early 90s, Nissan uh, raced in what was called the Coors Race Truck Challenge. And uh, it was a bunch of two wheel drive trucks, exactly like this. All the uh, import and domestic manufacturers were involved. So there were S10s, there were Rangers, there were Toyota pickups, there were uh, Zuzu Pups, and then there were a bunch of uh, factory sponsored hard bodies, and there was also a bunch of uh, independent uh, hard bodies running around out there. And if you look, there's still some running around uh, Road Atlanta right now. They're in the ITT truck class. Um, there's uh, at least one or two that I know of. Um, so you check that check that out it's pretty cool but basically it was a two-wheel drive truck quote-unquote stock they had some allowances on what they could do to uh, hop them up and it seemed the Nissan had the list of more modifications than anybody else I'm not exactly sure why but one of the things that they did was they ran these uh, AR62 uh, outlaw two wheels on them because they're really super lightweight and uh, they ran 215 60 15 tires I believe and so of course this truck is kind of a tribute to those trucks I wanted it to be streetable I wasn't gonna do the color scheme or anything on it I just wanted it to be like a nice little street truck and so I came across that set of AR 62s last year and I polished them up and put them on the, the red truck for a little bit but they didn't look exactly look right on that truck but here on this truck the way it's set up it's absolutely perfect and it rides so nice so this is the green truck for 2019 got a brand new set of Sumitomo HTR AS P02 tires in 215 60R15s front and rear same size because this truck is running 354 gears so I don't have to worry about having bigger tires in the back it's it's very tame in the highway it's actually uh, doesn't accelerate as violent as the red truck does um, that's mainly in the gearing uh, engine wise they're exactly the same so I can get the same size front and rear and I think uh, it brings this truck out perfectly I like the frontier rims that I had on last year but I had the same rims on since 2010. I hadn't changed anything since 2010. So, well, other than lowering it and doing some of the body work after hitting the deer with it, but other than that, tire-wise and wheel-wise, I had the same tires on since 2010. So I figured it was time for a change. And I hope you guys like uh, what I did, because uh, I sure do. So give me a thumbs up, thumbs down, leave a comment down below, like, share, and subscribe. There's lots of material on this channel. We're over 200 videos, and we're coming close to 2,000 subscribers. I can't thank everybody enough. My uh, five things that you didn't know about the uh, Nissan Hardbody video was my most popular video to date, uh, like recently. And uh, I really appreciate that. It seems like a lot of people really enjoyed having that kind of information. And I'd like to do another one in the future. I'm going to do some more research and dig up some more stuff. Uh, and hopefully uh, I can bring you some more material. In the meantime, if you need to contact me, you can contact me at NissanRallyCrossTruck at gmail.com. Or you can find me on Instagram, which is Rainmaker underscore D21. I post 
pretty much everything that I do right on that and then uh, make update videos. So hopefully you all enjoy it and uh, have a great day. Take care now.